Welcome aboard the Hudson River Sloop Clearwater. We're a traditionally rigged gaff rig sloop. 76 feet on deck, 24 foot of beam, and 108 foot sparred length. We steer the boat with a large 12 foot tiller. Our mainsail is the third largest traditionally rigged mainsail in North America. It's 3,000 square feet. It rides up to the top of our mast, which is 108 feet to the top of the topmast. Our forward sail, our jib, is a third the size of our mainsail. And right forward of our jib horse is our forwardmost compartment, the forecastle. Hi, welcome to the forecastle. The word forecastle is short for forward castle. Here, up to five crew members sleep here each night. And what's really cool about the forecastle is that the main mast comes down through the deck and into the forecastle and you can see and even touch it. This is the hold. This is our line locker where we keep spare line. And it's also the home of our third sail, the topsail. This is also where we keep our pennant. Oh, hi! This is the engine room. This is the original 1969 Marine Diesel Cummins engine. And this is our distribution panels. Our 12 volt, which gains power from our 12 volt battery bank, and our 120 volt that gets power from either shore power or our generator. Hello, this is the bosun's locker where we've got the tools and supplies to repair the ship while underway, as well as the storage for our diesel fuel and one of our water tanks. Hello, welcome to our galley, which is the maritime word for a kitchen. We are lucky to be fully equipped with a sink with running water, refrigerator, otherwise known as a reefer, and a stove and an oven. Uh, almost all of our food gets composted. Yeah. Welcome to the main Welcome cabin. Welcome to the main cabin. Um, here we sleep, eat, and play a lot of board games. The cabin sleeps 13 people at full capacity. Um, in the back we have our transom where six people sleep. And we also have a painting and guitar set up for our founder, Pete Seeger, who helped us sail this boat in 1969. A unique feature of our cabin are stained glass windows depicting the history of the river. For a long time, the people native to the area used the river on canoes, after which Henry Hudson sailed up it in his ship, The Half Moon. Following that was the era of the cargo sloops, of which we are a modern day replica. Yes, and then followed by the steamboat era, which ruled the Hudson for quite some time, until the tugboat came along. You know took it over. <laughs> Hi, this is the captain's cabin. It's where we keep the captain. Thank you so much for coming aboard the Sloop Clearwater. <laughs> 